have sworn that I was walking into a Starbucks. Hi, welcome to heaven. Is that like a new coffee shop? No, you died and you're in heaven now. Okay, where are the cameras? I'm being pranked, right? It's not a prank. You dropped your phone going into Starbucks and then an elderly woman ran you over. That's a tragic way to die. Maybe you should get off your phone. This isn't heaven just yet. You have to have enough good points to go. Otherwise, you go to the bad place. I don't want to go there. Then you have to go back to Earth to make amends with those you've hurt. Okay, fine. I'll go back to Earth to right my wrongs. The first person you must see is Lacey. Oh my god, no, I hate her. You have to apologize. Fine. Hey, Lacey. Ah! But you just died. I've come back to make amends with you. I'm sorry, it was wrong of me to give you food poisoning so that I could have the lead in the school play. You did that? That's not why I hate you. What? You let my pet bird fly away. Oh yeah, I'm sorry for that too. No, you're not. You know what? I don't forgive you. What? You failed and have two more chances. Would you like to take them? Okay, yes, I'll take them. You have two more chances. Would you like to take them? Okay, yes, I'll take them. The next person is your older sister. Why would I need to apologize to my sister? She loved me. Are you sure about that? Hey, sis. Oh my god, am I hallucinating? No, I've come to make amends. No way, you can't fix what's been done. I don't even know what I did. I thought that you loved me. How could I love you? Our parents gave you everything and they gave me nothing. They clearly liked you more. But that wasn't my fault. But you never stuck up for me or tried to include me. Listen, I'm sorry that they didn't treat you the same as they treat me, but I love you and I would never mean to hurt you like that. I'm sorry too. I've been holding a grudge for so long, but I can let it go. I should have told you how I felt sooner. It's okay. I forgive you. I don't want any bad blood between us. Congratulations, you succeeded. One more and you'll make it to heaven. I can do it. Who is it? Your mother. No, I'm not doing that. You have to unless you want to go to the bad place. I turned myself into one of those girls from The Purge. When I tell you this feels crunchy on my face, I can't even describe what I'm feeling right now. What would you do if I robbed your house like this, pajamas and all? We're gonna take it off. First thing to go is the spike choker. Why do I look like a toddler? Last time I used a Burt's Bees makeup wipe, I was so surprised by it. We're gonna start with my mouth. That eyeliner is so stubborn. Oh my God, is my face gonna be stained pink? R.I.P. this makeup wipe. Ugh. For the eyelid. Please, I don't want to be pussy pink forever. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Somebody lock her up. I'm going to try some cleansing oil, but I can't seem to figure out how the fuck you open this. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I should have used this oil from the beginning. This is great. Okay, I'm going to go wash this off and we'll see what I look like. <gasps> Is this what I deserve for trying to do makeup for once? I look like a clown who just got home from the circus. At least pink is my favorite color. I might be pink forever. Ready with me while I tell you why my mom is literally a bitch. So yesterday I went into Sephora with my mom and I went over to Drunk Elephant because I wanted the retinol drops and she literally wouldn't get them for me because she said I didn't need it. Honestly though, I think she's just jealous because she looks like a leather handbag, but it gets worse because she got the worker to come over and say whether or not it was safe to put on my face. And she literally said no. And I was like, why are you both ganging up on me right now? I just wanted some Drunk Elephant. So obviously I did the only reasonable thing and I started sobbing in the store and then I swept everything off of the Drunk Elephant display. Like, I guess it all worked out in the end because she ended up getting it for me anyway. Either way, I'm still mad because I asked her for a Tiffany's bracelet for Christmas and she literally got me one from Claire's. Like, ugh, I would never be caught dead wearing that. And then I asked her for a Lambo for Christmas and she literally got me an American Girl doll. Like, those two things are not even remotely close to each other. She said it's because I can't drive, but like, I'm gonna be able to drive eventually, so why not just buy the car now? Anyway, I literally just want to move out because this household is so toxic. Get ready with me to drop my best friend because she's a fake ass bitch. I had this boyfriend, Brian, and like everybody knew because we had been dating for a whole four days and she knew that. And she was over at my house and she was like, I'm cold, can I get a sweatshirt? And I said, yeah, but go to the back because I didn't want her wearing any of my nice ones and getting them all smelly. So I leave her whatever because I had to go to the bathroom and when I come back, she's literally wearing my boyfriend's fucking hoodie. I started screaming at her, but she tried to be all like, oh my God, I didn't know that it was your boyfriend's hoodie. I had no idea. I just knew that wasn't true because he's an identical triplet and his mom puts his name on every time tag of every clothing item he has. I kicked her out, but she's just so jealous because her mom only buys her CeraVe and not Drunk Elephant, and that's why nobody will date her. Plus, before this, for my birthday, she literally got me a make-your-own bracelet bead kit from Walmart. Like, do I look like I'm five? It's a new year, and I can't afford to have fake friends, so I'm going over to her house to tell her that she's a homewrecker, and I hate her.
Get ready with me while I tell you why I'm literally gonna sue Sephora because their worker ruined my life. Yesterday, me and eight of my closest best friends went in there to go dip our grubby little hands into all the tester product. After like 20 seconds of being in the store, one of the employees came over to us and was like, do you need help with anything? Personally, I wanted a different worker to help us because her makeup looked like shit and she was like 25, which is so old and not up to the trends at all. One of my friends says, yeah, we need the drunk elephant bronzing drops now. But this bitch says, oh, we actually just ran out of those. So we all started screaming at her, like just go get some more from the back. It's really not that hard to just do your job but she keeps insisting that they don't have any and clearly she wasn't using it because she was so pale so we told her to point us to summer friday's lip balm instead she told us that they were out of those too like do you guys have anything in this entire store hello only reasonable response was for me to throw a tantrum and all of my friends started throwing tantrums too because they got like triggered by me you would not believe this she comes back over to us and tells us that we're banned for 30 days and that we need to leave the store immediately and it turns out that my sister had the drops all along so i guess i didn't really need to do all that but like whatever Hey guys, get ready with me to go buy my first house at 17. Technically, I'm not buying it. My daddy is because I've never had a job before. I tried working a lemonade stand once when I was a kid and it was just not for me. Though I'm like kind of upset about it because the house that I wanted had four garages and my dad only ended up getting the house that had three garages. So now one of my Ferraris is gonna have to sit in the driveway. Like I'm gonna put like the really old Lambo that my dad gave me in the driveway. I know he said it was classic and vintage, but I don't really care about it because it's ugly and like the paint is peeling off of it. I've been asking what I plan on doing for a job but I actually just planned on marrying rich so I don't think I'm ever gonna have to get a job I don't really understand why more parents don't buy their kids houses sooner My friend's parents won't buy her a house So she's gonna live in one of the 15 guest rooms that are in mine instead I think I'm gonna turn one of the spare guest rooms into a zoo because I figured out it's only $30,000 to buy a giraffe and like that's my favorite animal So I think I'm gonna do it. anyway bye I'm gonna go buy some pillows at Dior so that my dog can sleep on them ready with me while I tell you why I'm never speaking to my mom ever again. A while ago, she gave me an emergency credit card and she told me to only use it if I was actually having an emergency. We got into this whole argument because she said skincare is not an emergency and I said, yes, it is, but clearly she doesn't get it because by the looks of her skin, she's never even seen or touched skincare. She took my credit card away, so I'm filing for emancipation of a minor because I don't want to have to deal with her anymore. Also because when I flushed our hamster down the toilet, she got so mad at me. Like, why? She basically said you're only supposed to flush a fish and I said, well, why did the hamster or go down the drain then. My mom said that we were gonna bury him, but at this point I wanna bury her instead. By the way, I'm getting ready to go burn all of her belongings in the backyard. So this is the final look. Mwah, love you. He says, what's up? Where's my Stanley cup? What? You don't even own one. I need one. I'm not buying you that. It's like $50. All my friends have them and if I don't have one, I'm not gonna be cool. If your friends judge you for a cup, they don't like you. I hate this household. I'm leaving forever and I'm never coming back. Okay, but if you leave, there's no Wi-Fi on the street then I'm not going. What are you doing? Leave me alone. I'm showing them my 14 step skincare routine. Nobody cares. How did you even get that? Can you go away now? You're ruining my light. Uh, excuse me. Ooh, are your leggings Lululemon? Um, no, I got them with my Kohl's cash. Ew, I only wear Lululemon. Okay, nobody asked. Can we go to Air One? I wanna try the Hailey Bieber skin smoothie. There's no way we can go to Air One. Why not? Because we're in Massachusetts. Fine, I'll just go by myself. Really? How are you gonna get there? I'm gonna walk. Yeah? Good luck with that. And I'm taking the Sol de Janeiro with me. Come on, we have to go to school. But first, coffee. Ew, no way you just said that. I cannot function until I've had my coffee of the morning. That's so cringe. Mom wants a selfie of us together. Smile. Oh my god, what was that? I'm doing the duck face. Don't ever do it again. I thought it was trendy. Maybe in 2013. That was embarrassing. Okay, I won't. She wants me to take a video of you saying hi, too. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm ready. Okay, it's recording. Hi, Mom. Okay, stop. Why did you pause like that? What do you mean? Don't pause. Just say it when I record. It's recording. Hi, Mom. Oh, dude, you did it again. Why are you doing that? I don't know what you're talking about. Huh? Are you wearing skinny jeans? Yes, I love skinny jeans, and I love tucking my sweater into them. I can't be seen with you while you're dressed like that. That lip color is way too light for you. Stop being a Karen. That's not even how you use that word. Oh. I know you told me not to eat your leftovers, but I ate them anyway. You suck. I was going to eat that for lunch. Guess the artist for what? A lot of money. If you can't even count, then you're doomed. You should not play. Not true. I know I at least have a few brain cells. Blonde made a football man famous in midnight. Hey, football's the one where you kick it, right? We're going to be bankrupt because of you. Whatever you do, you cannot get out. What happens then? You used to just be fine, but now they take the money and you die. Is it because footballers play at night? No, that seems wrong. I'm not allowed to give you any help. You have to figure it out on your own. Look at his little nose. I love it. Um, what are you doing? 
I'm watching that dog trend on TikTok. You are so stupid. Wait a second. I can't believe it took you so long to figure out. Taylor Swift? Yes. I knew I was smart. Penguin Techniques? I don't know. What the fuck are you talking about? Guess the artist again? No, you barely got it last time. You can't risk it. If you lose, you'll make everyone bankrupt. Sorry, did you say that I should do it? Because I agree. Purple, brunette, and vampire. <gasps> Adam Sandler! We're screwed. Why would it be Adam Sandler? I don't know. He's probably worn purple before. It's musical artists. Oh, I know. Harry Styles. I think someone dropped you as a baby. Victoria Justice. No, I don't think they just dropped you as a baby. I think they threw you at the wall. Really? Hey, what's that record? I don't know. I found it in the basement. I think it's Dad's. You're so stupid. Read it. I already did. It says Olive. Of course you can't read. Do it one more time. Olivia Rodrigo. Ugh, finally. Hey, I got a point. No, excuse me? How much energy did you get today, honey? 2%. No, that's not good at all. Bailey, you cannot be sleeping on that right now. Well, he's my friend. You're supposed to lead us in the debate. You're gonna make us all fail. Here, drink this. What is it? It's a secret magic potion. Good, I think it'll make you feel better. How do you feel? Oh, okay. Are you good? Have you guys ever done a backflip? Because I've never done one what I feel like I'm doing right now. Yeah, I don't think you should try that. Do you remember the debate materials? Oh yeah, I remember everything since the beginning of time. Okay, let's hope that you do well then. Would both parties please introduce themselves? Hi, I like sleeping, eating, going to the bathroom, having snacks, going to the gym, going for a hike, painting. Okay, that's quite enough. And stop moving. I can't stop moving. It's in my blood. I got the dancing juices going through me. This is not dance class. What was in that drink you gave me? Can I have four more of them? I've never felt better in my entire life. I feel like I conquered the entire world right now and become president i think i made a mistake bailey hello she's on zero you shouldn't have given her that drink dude i think you broke her uh nurse i can bring her energy back up but we don't know where it will land do it we need her to win okay she's back whoa that's way too much energy where is she going wait where did you just go i just ran an entire lap around the school do you want to see me do it again i can do it in one second nurse you have to try again this can't be right all right let me try restarting the system again maybe it'll fix her no, no, no. Now she doesn't have any energy at all. We need her. I don't feel so well. Suck it up, cupcake. You need to try it again. She's literally snoring. I can restart one more time, but any more than that and she'll die. <gasps> 89%. That's perfect. She can compete. Hashi Bubeldorf. Um, what did you just say? Says Kombiabia. Oh, I forgot to mention there might be some side effects to the restart. Magic bear or magic dog. I hope it's a panda. They're so cute. It's not even a real bear. I got scammed. Hey, can I hold your bear? Sure. I'm dating a frog. Sorry, what did you just say? Uh, I have no idea. Hey, Michelle, hold this. I sleep with a Lightning McQueen nightlight. What? What's wrong? Why are you looking at me like that? I think I started my period. Gotta go. I knew you were a baby, but the bear is much. You're just jealous you don't have one. You're right. I'll take yours. I sleep with a photo of you above my bed every night. What? What just happened? <laughs> Don't worry about it. So, you're the sparkly pink bear of secrets. Hey Jack, will you do my math homework for the rest of the year? Definitely not, are you crazy? I snuggle a pillow pet every night. <laughs> do my math homework or I'll tell everyone that you still sleep with a pillow pet. Jeff is my baby. I've thought about killing you before. What was that? I said I've thought about killing you before. I left for two seconds and you finished my drink? Yeah, sorry, I was thirsty. The beauty standard is black hair? What am I supposed to do? I'm blonde. You better go get some hair dye. No way, it took me like a year to get it here. Then I don't know what to tell you. I think I have a plan. Okay, can you tell that this is a wig? Oh, I don't know, is the sky blue? I didn't think it was that bad. It's worse than bad, it's tragic. It was my only choice, so let's hope that it works. Wow, you actually dyed your hair black? Yeah, I did. Why are you bald? If I'm bald, how are they gonna know what color my hair is? I can't tell if that's really smart or really dumb. I'm a genius. Everyone in line for checks. We better get in line. Next. Hi. Shut up and stand still while we screen you. All <sighs> right, you're good. I passed. Where's Lacey? She didn't make it out of the screening because she was bald. How did they know? They just made her show her armpit hair. She's locked in jail with everyone else who was rejected. We have to save her. Are you crazy? We can't save her. We have to save Lacey. Are you crazy? We could get in so much trouble. Oh, finally, I can take this wig off. Huge lips. That's perfect. Looks like you don't have to do anything. Hey, my lips are not that big. Yours are paper thin. What are you going to do? I'd like to introduce you to my friend Lip Liner. Your turn. I know what I have to do. 
Okay, how do I look? Ah, oh my god, what the? I kind of like it. Are your eyes working okay? Okay, what's the plan? After this check, we're going to sneak out when they're not looking and go to say Lacey. You're crazy, but I kind of like it. Next. It's impolite not to say hello. Last time you told me to shut up. Whatever, just stand still. All right, you're good. Hey. Okay, quick, follow me. How did you know this bookshelf is a door? I was trying to read Harry Potter once, but I opened this door instead. That seems like a bad book to hide it on. The jail is just down that hallway. Hey, what are you two doing? What are you two doing down here? Uh, we're here to promote you. Really? I've been needing this. Congratulations, you are now one of the elite employees. Thank you, I have to go call my mommy. I can't believe that actually worked. I can't believe he called his mom mommy. No eyebrows, I am not shaving mine off. Don't worry, I have a different plan. Okay, I'm done. Ah, what did you do to me? I tried to cover up your eyebrows. Okay, I guess this will work. Aren't they gonna miss us at the beauty tech? No, they're just gonna assume that we're absent. You better hope so. There she is, Lacey! Guys, you have to get me out of here. They're planning something really evil. Oh, what's wrong? I thought they were just holding you here because you didn't fit the standard. No, they plan on making it impossible so they can lock everyone up. We'll let you out, where are the keys? The guard keeps him on his belt. Hey, you two again, and I didn't even get a raise. Oh, shit. I didn't even get a raise. You're right, I'm sorry, we lied. That's it, you two are coming with me right now. No, wait, listen, the reason that we had to come down here is because my friend has a huge crush on you. What? Oh, really? Yeah, she's pretty cute. Yeah, she had to come down here to know your name. Oh, it's Bartholomew. Uh, why don't we go chat down the hall? Aw, bye. Have fun, you guys. Why would you send him away? He has the keys. Oh, don't worry. I got it. What? How did you do that? I snuck it off his belt while he was flirting. Shit, it changed again? We don't have time to go get a nose job. Don't worry. I got this one. Okay, I'm done. What did you do to your face? It was the best that I could do, okay? Quick, get in line. It's like we were never gone. Next for the beauty check. Hold it right there, miss. Something is wrong. W what do you mean something's off? We're looking for a suspect who looks just like you. We're gonna hold you here until we can confirm it's not you. You can't hold me here. We actually can. What happened to your nose? Why is it so big? Hey, my nose is not big. You must have altered it to fit the standard. You can't do that. Hold on, this new standard has to be a mistake, right? Nope, no mistakes have been made on our end. No one's gonna do that. Oh no, what a shame that is. You know what you have to do. No way, I'm not doing it. Then we have no choice but to fail you and lock you up. Fine. Oh my god, is there anyone who isn't locked up? Lacey's not down here. How did Lacey get out of it? Let's just say she won't be holding anything from now on. We're all locked <laughs> up and we can't get out. Why are you laughing? It's not funny. Because I never put the key back. I am in love <laughs> with you. I have to pee so bad. Let's go. They can't stop all of us. What is that noise? Uh, I think they might know that we all just left the jail. $20 to me or my mom. I don't really need it right now, so maybe she can use it. Morning to go and buy it. What did you get? I gave my 20 to my mom, so nothing. New car, what? Well, if I give it to my mom, she'll probably just give me G-Wagon for my car. <sighs> Wait, why aren't you taking any insane if you give this one to your mom, too? Well, I'm probably still gonna live with her. No, you're gonna <laughs> regret that. Ooh, I could get a mansion on the before. I think I just got $10 million. Um, what? What do you- To give me some of that. You can have some. I can't keep it all, but I have to sell to, okay? I love her. I want some of the money, too. $20 to me or my mom. I don't really need it right now, so maybe she can use it. Morning to go and buy it. What did you get? I gave my 20 to my mom, so nothing. New car, what? Well, if I give it to my mom, she'll probably just give me G-Wagon for my car. <sighs> Wait, why aren't you taking any insane if you give this one to your mom? Uh, I don't want a job. I just use my parents' money. Everyone is given a job. You don't get a choice. What is on my head? Santa! You get to be Santa? That's so cool! No, that's not so cool. I don't know how to get around the world. You'll figure it out. Hi, Santa. What did I get? Uh, here you go. Is that a paper towel? Yes, but it's a magic paper towel. Really? What does it do? I can't tell you that it'll ruin the Christmas spirit. Bye! Did you finally get me that bike I asked for? No, but I did get you Windex wipes. Here you go. Did you get me the iPhone? Here. Uh, I don't think that's the iPhone. Aren't you gonna be all joyful? Oh, right. Ho, ho, ho. You kind of scare me. Did I get a gift? Of course. I have something that I think you're gonna love. Is that a piece of hair? Yes, it is. Well, you see, this hair came off of a unicorn. <gasps> Give it to me! Are you Santa? Yes. You're fired. You're terrible at your job. You can't fire me. I'm Santa. You gave a child Windex. <gasps> 7-1?
What is my soulmate big ugly jean that you're gonna give them? <gasps> I am not ugly. Find him. Maybe he's like an NBA player. <laughs> not like that tall, right? Excuse me, I need to get look like Shrek. What? Shrek? Ooh. To him. Um, I think I know how we can. How? He um, 7-3. Ugh. You're not my soul. What do you mean you don't know? You are so weird. I'm out. Open your shoulders. Do you think that the brother goes here too? <laughs> Two of who? We need to get his attention. Expired May 1998. That's not that long ago. Wait, don't use that. Why not? It's just powder. I heard that it burned a hole in one girl's face. Are you seriously wearing that on your date tonight? Hey, what's wrong with this? It looks like you haven't washed it in a few days. At least my clothes don't look like they're from Kmart. <coughs> Ew, did you just throw up? Mm-hmm. You have to cancel if you're sick. But they're so hot. Hey, I'm not gonna be able to make it tonight. I just threw up. Sorry. Why did my Dodge death count just go up after I sent that text? Relax, it was probably because of the Uber or something. Who do you invite over? Uh, no one. Probably a salesman. Oh, hi. I felt bad that you were sick, so I brought you a drink. How did you find where I live? I didn't tell you. I have my ways. Here, the drink. Thanks. Take a sip. I'm okay. My grandma made it special for you. Okay, I'll be sure to try it later. Have a good night. I think my date is trying to kill me. Good, you're such an annoying sister. I think my date was trying to kill me. Good, you're annoying, I hope so. This man is still on the loose for killing multiple women. What's on the TV? Can you turn it up? Dude, wasn't that your date? You have to tell the police. I can't. I don't have any evidence of him doing anything. There must be something. I have to catch him myself. No, are you insane? A little. Hey, are you free tonight for a date? Send. He said yes. What kind of crazy person meets up with a killer? Hey, this is such a nice restaurant. I feel underdressed. You are, but whatever. So, what do you do for a living? I'm an actor. No big deal. Have I seen you in anything? Yeah, I was tree number three in The Wizard of Oz. Why don't you have some water before dinner? No, I'm not thirsty. So, where do you live? What? Is this an interrogation? Why do you care? Just curious. Your food looks a little bland. Let me put some salt on it. No, I don't want salt on my food. Stop. Is your phone voice recording? What? No, it's not. Yes, it is. I see it. Dude, that was my phone. Sorry, did you need that? Let's. I'm going to do my full face and makeup using only pink products. First up is some glow recipe. I just love their packaging. How fucking cute. Next up is the NYX Marshmallow Primer. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Hear me out on this one. This is the only face product I have and I am counting this as pink. I feel like nobody talks about this Benefit Boing Concealer, but it's genuinely so good. So I don't know why we don't. Well, this was pink, but it's dirty. I know people are going to fight about this, but please just let me have it because I do not have anything else that is even remotely pink for bronze. I already know the Rare Beauty is going to be good because Selena has never let me know. Blush this one from Sigma is actually pink and it's amazing you know what else is pink my favorite face powder also happens to be pink a win for me this powder will make you so airbrushed it's literally unbelievable my nails match the nyx brow glue perfectly did not have a pink brow pencil so let's hope that my natural brows will look cute today i'm gonna do a little bit of this pink oh that was a lot well, i was trying to make it natural but i don't know if that's happening i don't know how to feel luckily my favorite lip liner is already pink lastly some fenty gloss this is the final look and honestly i don't think i did a bad job at all definitely wish i had like a foundation or something but it's okay we'll get them next time tiger